So far, I have tried various large language models for story writing and role play. I believe that this new model, DreamGen Opus version 1, which is a new version of Opus, is one of the best model for story writing. I won't say it's the best for role play at the moment, but for story writing, I think this is one of the top notch model and I will be showing you after we install it locally on our Windows system. Now, this model is not only great for story writing, but also it is awesome for various other text uh, tasks like summarization, classification and a lot of other things. For example, if you just want general assistant, it can even do that. If you want question answering chatting, it can do that with ease too and we will also see a few of the examples. These Opus models are available in various sizes. Let me open it. There you go. So you can see that it is it is available in 7 billion, 34 billion uh, sizes. Plus there are some quads available too in AWQ and GGUF formats. Okay, good stuff. So now let's see how you can get it installed locally and then play around with it. The tool which I'm going to use for it is LM Studio. If you don't know what LM Studio is, I have done various videos uh, around LM Studio and you can check it out in the channel or in the video's description. Now the first thing you need to do is to go to the home page of LM Studio, just type Opus and then you will be presented with a lot of quantized versions from various people. I'll just go with the dream gen which have which are the original creator of this model and I have selected the top uh, biggest quant which is the Q8 and if you don't know what these quant levels are I have done another video on it which you can search on the channel. Now once you have done it, click on the folder icon and you can see this has already been downloaded and then from there click on these three dots and on the right hand side you can see that I already have set my GPU offload to max because I have one GPU of 16 GP VRAM and I intend to use it fully and my memory size is 32 GP of RAM. So I would suggest and recommend that in order to play around with these models you should have at least that sort of minimum spec. Now once that's done, I already have loaded my model from the top. Now before I run it, I am using my system prompt or um, pre-prompt as this, which is, if you look at it, it says that you are an intelligent, skilled, versatile writer. Your task is to write a story based on the information below. And then I'm giving it plot description. Now in this video, I'm going to show you a few examples how you can get start with story writing. Now one very important point before I show you this, that once, uh, you know, the better your prompt will be for story writing, the better the response of the large language model. So make sure that you make it as good as possible. Now you can even use another LLM like ChatGPT to get uh, to write these prompt templates. Now let me make this one a tad bit shorter so that I would be able to show you the whole stuff here let me sorry i'm just tinkering with it to make sure that you are able to see everything okay there you go much better okay now this is a prompt which i have created with the help of chat gpt the, here i'm saying is that you're an intelligent skilled writer your task is to write a story based on the information below and then i have created this uh, one paragraph of plot in this one i'm saying in a world where a magic and technology coexist, a mysterious artifact has been stolen from the royal archives. This artifact known as the Ether Compass is rumored to hold the key to an ancient power that could either advance society or lead to its destruction. A group of unlikely heroes must come together to retrieve the compass before it fails, falls into the wrong hands, leading them to an adventure across diverse landscape. And then I'm filling in the prompt down i am specifying some of the characters of the story so alex is a young individual skilled in both magic and technology but unlike their peers alex is shy introverted and struggles with feelings of loneliness so this is a character make it as colorful and interesting as possible now despite their brilliance alex's social awkwardness and fear of rejection often keep them on the sidelines the quest for ether compass becomes a journey of personal growth for alex then I'm just saying that, okay, user is this LLM and I'm saying that now using the information provided, 
राइट द बिगनिंग ऑफ स्टोरी सेटिंग द सीन एंड इंट्रोड्यूसिंग द मेन कन्फ्लिक्ट एंड देन दिस इज समथिंग आई एम जस्ट गिविंग इट दैट ओके जस्ट पुट द स्टोरी टेक्स्ट हेयर यूजर विल बी दिस एंड देन स्टोरी टेक्स्ट लेट मी प्रेस एंटर हेयर Where is my enter? Okay, let me. There you go. So I am going to press enter, and there you go. So it is going to create it. Let's wait for it to come back. There you go. So you can see that it has started generating the story. That Alex found themselves in dark alley, clutching at their chest, and it's going on and on and on. And then it has divided it into the chapter. And look at this, um, you know. setting of it i'm not of course going to read the whole story here because that will log time but as you can see it's a story and it will go on and on and on it's all running locally and privately so you can generate whatever you like whatever your tastes are uh, whatever you like to see it is great because this is an uncensored model so an sfw not safe for work so use it carefully there you go so i'm not going to play it the whole one but let's wait for a few more second and then i will stop it and i'm letting you read a bit okay so let's stop the rating because it won't stop any time soon cool now so this is one example let's go with another example one thing i have found out with lm studio it sometimes it's uh, just you know remember the previous chat so i'm going to remove this chat and i'm going to reload the model by clicking at the middle top and then reload the model and then give it the new story now this is a new prompt with a new story and this is sort of a legal thriller in this one the overall plot is that elliot reed a brilliant but disillusioned attorney stumbles upon a case that could make or break his career a large pharmaceutical company is accused of releasing a drug with deadly side effects and then this is the whole plot then i am just describing who is elliot reed in more detail he is cynical yet possesses a strong moral compass and then a uh, lot of stuff here now let's see what this does there you go this is how the story starts that he sat at his desk st staring at a stack of folders typical like a lawyer seems like john grisham to me but anyway So it's a legal thriller and it is just awesome. Look at that uh, woman look down at the folder and took a deep deep breath. Elliot felt a chill run down his spine. I mean, I hope that you can appreciate the creativity and innovation of this model. How cool is that? Beautiful. Okay so I will stop generating it because I think I could start reading it awesome stuff so let's cancel this then reload the model and then let's try out another example now this another example is a steamy romantic thriller again it's a uh, uncensored so you know just read it at your own peril now where here I'm saying is that Eva Marshall a talented and ambitious investigative journalist finds herself embroiled in a complex story involving Nathan Black who is a mysterious art dealer with rumored ties to the criminal underworld as Eva digs deeper into her investigation their paths cross in unexpected ways sparking a dangerous attraction that neither can deny their steamy encounters blur the lines between professional boundaries and personal desires as Eva uncovers layers of deception she begins to question Nathan's Nathan's guilt and her own ethical compass and then they navigate a maze of danger and then i'm describing a eva here more and then also nathan black both characters which we shown and they i'm just making as colorful as possible let's see the story so that's a start and i'm just saying continue the story by detailing the development of the relation so i'm not asking it to um, start it i just said it continue the story so it has just continued it how intelligent this model is awesome stuff beautiful okay now 
in the next one this is bit of a interesting one so in this there are two characters who are grappling with their sexual orientation and both are girls so let me cancel it reload the model and show you the template now here what i'm saying is that Lena Roberts, a dedicated high school teacher, and Emma Clark, a talented graphic designer, are brought together by a community project to create an educational campaign on environmental awareness. From the outset, their interactions are changed with an intensity neither fully understand. Lena, who has always identified as straight, finds herself unexpectedly drawn to Emma's creativity and zest for life. Meanwhile, Emma, who has never questioned her own straight orientation, feels a deep connection with Lena that goes beyond. more friendship or professional admiration as they collaborate closely their initial confusion and denial give way to recognition of their feeling so and then you know i'm describing lena more who is compassionate committed emma is vibrant and creative let's see what this model comes up with wow look at that so i'm just continuing the story so that is why There you go. So she never considered herself gay. That is awesome. How cool is that? Look at the dialogue happening between both Lena and Emma. This looks simply out of this world. A real story was by a very very seasoned, experienced writer. To go, oh my God, me too. Maybe I'm attracted to you. How cool is that? There you go. Beautiful, beautiful. And again, look at the end. It says this response is a creative writing based on the user's instruction, and doesn't involve any real world um, people or even. And look at this. That Lena felt herself melting into this case. How oh, how cool is that? The imagery and the way they have written it. Amazing stuff. Beautiful. Okay, so let me cl clear this. Reload the model. Let's try out one more. Now this is. again a plot with the supernatural and i'm just setting the scene that in the heart of victorian london a series of unexplainable events as the city on edge elinor ashford a young woman with a keen interest in the occult and the thomas blake and then i'm describing both thomas and elinor let's see there you go in the quiet corner of victorian london and then it is setting the scene and how beautiful is that it has gone back in the history but still maintaining the tempo of the story beautifully really awesome amazing stuff beautiful so that's done now as a final example let me just give it one um just a plot so i'm just giving it this plot that lela aziz A young Lebanese immigrant arrives in Sydney, Australia, with dreams of a new beginning. Facing the challenges of language barriers, cultural differences, and finding meaningful work, Lala's resilience and hope are tested at every turn. Through her journey, she forms a deep connection with Alex, a local with immigrant parents, and finds purpose in volunteering for a refugee organization. Let's see how the story goes. There you go. and she's reconciling so it has just started weaving the story around the reconciliation and the start how cool is that that upon arrival in sydney lela was greeted by her uncle who had offered to put them up until they find found a place of their own how cool and her mood improved when she met alex who a local who had immigrated from china cool now and you can then again you know start talking by it and then giving more ideas to this llm which it can take the story forward so you can hopefully appreciate that how good this model is i'm really really impressed by this let me know your thoughts on it and if you like you can play around with it and share your experience if you are facing any issues let me know happy to help out if you like the content then please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please do me a favor and share it among your network as that helps a lot thanks for watching